Hello everybody, my name is Jay Thunder Draws, and today I'm going to teach you on how to separate the line art from the white background so that you can add colors. Now, many people have given, uh, there's, there's two ways to do this. First off, you can change the layer type to multiply and then just draw above it. The downside of putting it on multiply is that multiply goes through several different layers at one time. So, what ends up happening is your colors end up darker than you intend them to be. So, we're not going to do that. I'm going to show you how you can separate this. This came in as, you can see, a .jpg. So, it's, you know, it's all one layer. There's no, you know, there's no, there's no different layers or anything. So, what you're going to do is go over to your layers over here on the right. Right click and go to, if I can find it. Convert layer. Click that. You'll see this little box here. Type on the top. It's a raster layer. Name, the whole name. You can rename it. Rename the layer while you're here. Name it lines. And then you're going to go into, it says expression con color. Go in there and hit gray. Now, what you're going to do, blending mode, keep it normal. You can keep the original layer. I don't care. I've got this saved in so many places it doesn't matter. So blending mode, okay, still normal. Now you see two boxes over here on the right. You're gonna see a white box and a black box. Click the, sorry, click black box. Make sure the white box is not selected. And hit OK. And now, Manga Studio has taken out everything but the black lines. So now you can make new layers. You can color underneath the lines without having to worry about much. And that's it. Now I need to uh, put in here that this line art is not mine. This was used for by uh, this was done the inks were done by Carlos Gomez Artis on DeviantArt. The inks were done by Edavitas also on DeviantArt. You can find the links to uh, their originals below. And uh, thanks for watching.